Country people, too much buzz was done they happen for inside palace this time around though. As we heard say that uh, Olori actually ex-husband. Yes, because you know say this Olori is where Kabi is still married into the palace. Almost all of them don't marry before, yes, and have children for their husbands before coming into the palace. And people don't they drag them say that all of you will come into this palace. All of you have been married. Why not stay with your husband? You they dear, they marry your husband, still they have relationship with Kabiesi. And as you don't finally share Queen Nagomi out of the palace, you don't leave your husband. Yes, your husband where you have children with, decide to come into the palace just to answer Queen and parade yourself around. Without knowing the kind of damage that you have caused. Yes, the kind of uh, damage that you have caused to your children. And that's also Wahala with the here since they left. Because either the children are brought into the palace or the ex husband come to the palace demanding to take their wife and their children. That's also film with the see for that inside palace. So now, another story we don't come be said that uh, Olori actually is uh, ex has uh, stormed the palace. Yes, to see Kabiesi. That uh, she has, he has been uh, trying to reach uh, Ashley for long now, almost three months. That Ashley doesn't want to answer her. That the only thing why he wants to reach Ashley because of uh, their daughter. Yes. Because Ashley and the man have a child. That is up to 10 years now or more about. But uh, Ashley, as a point, started uh, taking care of the child, only her. And started uh, distancing themselves. Yes, they do not want to relate with her husband again. As uh, we hear that is the reason why she has traveled to UK and stayed with her daughter there. So that uh, it would be very far for the man to set eyes on her daughter. That is what we are hearing where they saw for inside palace. As the man, as the ex of uh, Ashley cannot keep coming again. I have decided to come and present this matter to Kabi Esi. That's how can Kabi Esi start taking care of uh, his daughter while he is still alive. That it is unfair. It wasn't even when she, he came to the palace to complain all this to Kabi Esi. That Kabi Esi started also outpouring everything. Telling him to come and take uh, Ashley out of the palace. So, because the kind of hala where Ashley declared for inside palace, he plenty well well. So my country people now the matter will be this so as Ashley X don't carry problem come into the palace. Yes. They ask Kabi Esi that uh, he wants to see her daughter, that it has been long that Olori Ashley take away their daughter. Yes. And since then he has not set eyes on their daughter. But now it has started disturbing him. Though he has been providing her child care, everything that the child needed, paying into Olori Ashley's account. But he has not seen his daughter, and is willing to see his daughter now, and that is why he has come to the palace for Kabiesi, to help him, yes, and know how to talk to Olori Ashley, for her to allow him to see their daughter, because it is totally unfair. Yes, now waiting people, they talk, say, all these things, where the Olori's they do, how do they got the morale, the impetus to be acting like this? Because how can you deprive a daughter to see, to see her father? It is so much unfair. The father wants to be in her life. Why not allow him? Why preventing him from being in, in, in his daughter's life? He has been providing health, child care. He has been doing everything that is needed to be done. And you are still preventing her, him from seeing uh, his daughter. People are saying that it is totally unfair. That they don't know the reason self why Kabi Esi married all these Oloris. Now they are not giving him happiness. All of them are done already married before. Yes, they have children outside. And Kabi Esi married them into the palace. And if they start causing trouble again, Kabi Esi will say that... Uh, he doesn't know what is wrong with his wife, that they always cause problems. But problems fool their body because there is no way they are going to have peace in that palace since they already have children outside of the marriage. Yes, people don't they talk plenty things that Kabi is made the wrong move. 
that marrying all these Olubis is the worst mistake that Kabiese has made since he started governing the Ilefe people as a whole. So my country people, I beg, make you juke mouth for this matter. I say, Olori ex Ashley's ex-husband, don't come palace. They beg Kabiese. They demand say make Kabiese talk to Olori Ashley. That uh, he wants to see his daughter. That it has been long. Where Olori Ashley, they prevent him from setting eyes on their daughter. That the only thing where he wants now is that uh, Ashley should bring back their daughter to Nigeria so that uh, he will see her. Because if not, he will go an extra mile to see that uh, he, he takes away this child from Olori Ashley. Now waiting the man come palace, come the demand from Kabiesi. Though Kabiesi have assured him that uh, as far as he don't come palace with this problem, that it must be put mouth. Yes, that a new change will come out, that things will be done differently now. Now waiting Kabiesi tell him. I beg my country people make you choke mouth on this matter. Drop your comments at the comments section concerning Olori Ashley's ex storming the palace to demand that uh, Ashley should allow him to have access to their son or their daughter and see her. Now, waiting the man, come palace, come talk. Chuck mouth, yes. Drop comments at the comments section. Let's know your mind and waiting you feel about all this wahala, all this buzzwords. Where they saw for inside the palace of Oni. And for my returning subscribers, I appreciate you all. I say thank you. May God reward you. May God bless you as you always come back.